Yeah, the effort was was definitely there. Um, proud of our guys, the way we fought on all three phases. Obviously, being as shorthanded as we was tonight, um, still disappointed we didn't get the win um, because we were playing really well. At times, just shooting ourselves in the foot, bad penalties at bad times. Um, but like you said, I'm definitely proud of that effort. The effort was there. And how important you made no bones about it this week, but you were playing because you wanted to help lead and kind of set the tone, and clearly you did that tonight with a couple of picks. Yeah, man, I think that people had questioned, like, said some stuff like, oh, you should have sat out or whatever it may be. Like, I played this game for three reasons. You know, first and foremost, I played this game to glorify God. I played this game for my family, and then I played this game for the people that's in this room right here. And, um, you know, if I'm healthy and I'm, I'm ready to go, I'm going to go. Because, like I said, I mean, these guys are busting their behinds out here every single week. Some of these guys ain't 100 either. But they go out there and fight, so I'm going to do the same exact thing. That's, that's my job as a leader. What did you think about something? Joshua Dobbs and just the boost he gave this offense tonight? And, and what did it do for the defense? Yeah, I mean, I think he did a really good job of just, you know, Coach always talk about the operation. Um, I think Todd did some good things, you know, kind of moving him outside the pocket, doing some things like that. He made some really good throws. Um, Obviously, he's only been here for like a week or two, but I definitely think, you know, as long as he continues to progress, um, I'm sure we'll see him next week for sure. First meeting Saturday night that this team only fans more. How important was it to you and this team to give that to them? I know y'all see sick. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's still disappointing we didn't get the win. Uh, we went to this game trying to win this game. Uh, you obviously seen with the effort that we played with, so it's disappointing. Um, but I can guarantee you this, that, you know, I'm going to make sure that everybody – and we're going to have a couple of days off, but, you know, the mind, mentally, physically, get prepared to go win a playoff game. That's pretty much what it is. A playoff game, you win, you keep playing. If you lose, we all go home. How can you build this momentum, KB, off of this, this week to next week where all the cards are on the table next week? Yeah, I mean, like I said, the effort was there. Obviously, we're going to have some, some guys come back from injuries and things like that. So uh, it's going to be great to get some of those guys back and get them more healthy. Um, but, yeah, I mean, it's kind of hard to build momentum off a loss, you know what I'm saying? But, like I said, we always going to play with effort. We're, that, that's something that's a fundamental uh, building block of this program and this team. So the effort's always going to be there, but we have to find ways to, you know, not have those bad penalties, those pass interference, roughing the passers, things like that. And I, don't, I think that was kind of a bad call, but we can't put it in the hands of the refs. So we got to stop shooting ourselves in the foot because if we don't, we can win ball games. Russian football with the Cowboys, so... Um, I thought we blocked him up pretty good for him, and he made some good throws. What's he like kind of in the huddle from, from day one? Does he have a presence to him? Is he like yeah, so it's another guy with another calming presence. You know, he's not a big rah-rah guy, but, you know, he, he gets the guys locked in, and there's a confidence about it. So, we, you know, we feel good going in with every play. Is this something to maybe build on going into next week? Not only, you know, is the offense working a little better, but you're getting dudes back, obviously, next Right. Yeah, it's definitely something to build on. Um, you know, it, as long as we can protect and get balls out and, and run the football how we know how to, um, we're always going to have a chance, especially when our defense plays that way. Um, we're always going to have a chance. Corey, what did Josh bring to the huddle tonight and then with his performance on the field? Um, you know, like I, I just said, uh, he, he brought, you know, a confidence, like, you know, you don't want to be calm in a football game, but he, he brought a calming presence. Like, you know, we were never out of it. Um, like I said, there was just a focus, and, and I thought we did a pretty good job other than, you know, penalties and things like that. But there's, there's obviously always stuff to work on. And, uh, but as far as Josh, I mean, he gave us a great chance to win. Lose, and um, again, this was another opportunity to win, which is what we wanted, but now it's behind us, 24-hour rule, and then next week is a playoff game. Okay. What do you think about Josh Dobbs' performance tonight and just how much did that kind of pump you guys up from the sidelines seeing those drives? Yeah, I mean, for a guy that just got here, uh, to go out there and put some points up against a good defense like that and then stand in there and take some uh, big hits with a pass rush that was all over him, um, that's what you expect out of a guy and for him to go out there and um, show that he's ready to compete for his team and can do some good things is always positive because it's going to be a team collective team, whatever, team effort. Rashad, what were the positives you take from tonight's game? Uh, I got to watch the film. You know, I, I don't know. You know, sometimes you think you did something good. You might not. In some plays you think are terrible. Could have did it right. But like she said, hold him under 100 yards rushing for a leap back. But, 
you know, I'm one of the true positives to ever watch the film. Do you feel like there was anything different that time? There felt like there was a, this was a game no one outside of this room gave you a shot at. And it felt like there was some juice for a long time that you guys might do something special here tonight. Yeah, I mean, for, for me, which I really took the heart uh, two days ago, KB said, you know, this is a great opportunity, not because of guys being down or in young young guys, the other guys getting an opportunity, but because it was the next game. So it was a, it was a great opportunity because it was the next opportunity, and uh, that's what we got next week. So I think um, we just went in there to prove a point that, like you said, when, when no one believes in you or anything, you got to go in there, hold your own, and let them know it won't be a cakewalk.